action. <laughs> <laughs> okay. How do I? How do I look? Do I look okay? As good as you're gonna look. This is as good as it gets, huh? Hi guys, Ethan here with Sayo Fox. Uh, so today I'm gonna show you my finally completed project, which took way too long, but I have a lot going on, so I apologize. Uh, but here is my mint cage. Um, so it took. It should realistically, it should have taken me like three weeks, but it took me like three months. So I'll give you a little tour, um, some of the features that I did, uh, and show you kind of some of the enrichment that we added for the mink to play around in, and also how we can rotate three mink in one cage versus kenneling them in and out between multiple cages. So I'll give you a look around. Right here we have one of the uh, separate enclosures from the large one, and Mr. Mink is in there. Hi, Mr. Mink. So what we have. Over here is another one that's completely the same. Um, we also have a water drainage here, which is for the large water tank inside. So you can actually hook a garden hose up to that and refill it once you drain it. And then over here, we have another one. And I can kind of show you how this works. It's a two level system. On the bottom there, they have a mink cage or a mink box, I should say. So if you look in there, they have a tiny little hole. They can make a nest. The top of that does open up for easy cleaning. And so does the top of this. So I tried to make these as easy as possible to be cleaned. So the whole top opens up. We have a little latching hinge there, a litter box. And if you take the litter box out, you can actually grab this shelf right here. And the whole thing comes right up out of there. So you have complete access to everything super easy to get to all of it and get it nice and clean. Also, if you come down here on the bottom, we have a latch right here with a safety hook just in case. And you can open that and get to the bottom. So you can scrape off any poop that may have missed the litter box. And on top of that, for easier feeding and watering, we have this right here. And you can fill up their food and water dish super easy without getting your fingers chomped. So that's nice. <laughs> so that is the small cage where they can go individually so they're not, you know, intermingling and trying to murder each other. And now I will take you for a walkthrough of the large section of the cage. Hello. Hello. <laughs> so if we come around here to the large cage, go right in here. This door does have a spring-loaded hinge system on it. So the door closes automatically to prevent any accidents and, you know, leaving the door cracked open and the mink getting out. Uh, we also have the three doors to the individual mink cages. So we can unclip the safety latch, swing it open and give that mink large cage time, then put them away and rotate the next one out. Uh, we also have a little house here for the mink, a tunnel, and we have a lot of sticks and branches and all that stuff for them to climb on all over the place. And there's Michaela. Hi. Hi. <laughs> uh, they do have another litter box in here and I'm working on figuring out a heating system for that tank that they cannot chew through because that would be terrible. All right. Here we go. Let's see how long it takes me to figure it out. <laughs> Hi. Hi, buddy. Thank you. 
Just don't jump to my head or something. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's thinking about it. He was. <laughs> oh. oh my god. <laughs> That's embarrassing. You gotta work on your landings, buddy. <laughs> I promise you can swim. Oh, there he goes! <laughs> yeah, you did it! His first paddle. You did it! Sorry, he's, <laughs> he's so scared. <laughs> Come on, buddy, be brave. Look. Brave. Oh, you gotta get my fingers now. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> he's so, he's like a, just a little baby. He's like a baby bird trying to fly for the first time. <laughs> oh, there you go. Yeah, you did good. Oh. <laughs> so that's my mint cage. Uh, I'm sure I will be building a lot more cages in the future when I have time, which <laughs> seems kind of rare lately. If you have any suggestions on what you would add or do differently, <laughs> stop laughing. <laughs> if you have any suggestions on what you would do differently, leave it in the comments. I do try to check them once in a while and maybe I'll add it to it. So uh, yeah, thank you for watching and we'll see you guys next time.